<laughs> 43 here. May I introduce to you um, those who haven't yet met Mary? I think Mary has met most of you now. Mary was until earlier this year rector of Hazelmere in Surrey, uh, so she's quite posh. <laughs> <laughs> Sunrise. Mary yeah. lives in Bishop's Clee, but uh, enjoys worshipping with us in our team, so it's great to be able to welcome her to Presbury and look forward to you helping in due course with, with various things. <laughs> but in the meantime, you have a notice about Ethiopia. Yes. I, I, um, you may think this is an odd thing to be talking about on, on Clee Common on Easter morning, but um, it struck me that you might well be a sample of the more intrepid members of the, um, the, the team and so I wondered if anybody here might be interested in a pilgrimage I'm leading to Ethiopia in the autumn. Um, 11 days of faith, 11 culture days. and the most amazing landscape of people. Ethiopia is not on most people's bucket list <coughs> but it has a Christian history which is quite different from any other. It was never colonialised and it was a Jewish faith which passed almost seamlessly, it seems, into, um, into Christianity. The churches are extraordinary. The landscape is beautiful. And it's just a wonderful, wonderful trip. I've been twice now, and I led a pilgrimage last autumn. Um, if anybody is interested, there are, um, there are some leaflets in St Mary's, or I will work out a way that you can get in touch with me, or have a quick word. But it, it's, um, I mean, I can't pretend it's cheap. But it's, 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 it's excellent value because it's absolutely all in, including internal flights and things. It's with McCabe, who are, in my opinion, the best pilgrimage um, organisers. And I'm so looking forward to going, and it would be lovely to build some relationships within, within this new place, as well as where I've come from. So if you'd, like, if you'd be interested, please do have a word with me, pick up a leaflet, <coughs> and... Um, Yes, thank you very much. Thank it's lovely to be here. Pilgrimage to Ethiopia. Now, the Reverend Coco has asked me to, uh, to remind everybody uh, that his mum and dad, Sarah and Neil, uh, are going to take a this candle here, which has been lying in front of our altar, a uh, beautiful Paschal candle for this year with the lovely uh, emblems and motifs on it, the Alpha and the Omega, the beginning and the end, and this year. And Sarah, where is this going to go next from here? David's the one that... Right. Prosperi. Oh. David. Well, Prosperi. 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 For those, those who are walking, um, we're going to walk down to our house in Chalk Green Lane and have a bit of breakfast. Yes! Um, <laughs> you know, there's some coffee and some hot cross buns there. Um, we're then going to try and time it that we leave our house in order to, to get to St Mary's shortly before 8 to welcome that congregation then go to All Saints for about half past eight to greet them as they finish their breakfast, then go to St Nicholas for about nine o'clock, <laughs> um, and, and of course have some coffee and comfort to stop and greet them, leave before their half past nine service to get to um, um, Village for about ten to get to Elmston Hardwick. For about half past ten. Services half past ten, David. Yeah, I know. Don't oh. worry. We're going to be Services there. Services a quarter to eleven, I think. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that is planned. Yeah. Uh, yes. Right. So, uh, good luck. Well, once, so. once we've finished, if the walkers sort of gather around That's me, fun. then I can uh, yeah. lay down in. We'll go down to the field. Could stroll down together. Meanwhile, you have Costa Clean here. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>